and happy new year guys yeah my room is sounding super barren <laughs> yeah uh as you guys can see i'm back at school but that's not really what this is about um i know like I'm, i don't want to get super uh like depressing i guess but on a more personal note uh 2020 was a really not great year um i i don't know about you all um but I had a lot of ups and downs uh, in my personal life. Um, and really, you know, I like to focus on the positive. I like to focus on uh, the good things that happen and uh, not as much the bad things. So um, not to dwell on the downs, but uh, holy shit, guys, 2020 was rough. I, I think we can all agree. Uh, I... Not again, not to dive too deep into stuff, but um, I, I got to see some people I'm very close to hit very, very hard by quarantine and personal events in their own lives. And um, it was really hard for me to watch uh, all of that. And then that's kind of why I'm glad I had the, the, the upsides. For those of you who didn't know, I actually had, I've had this YouTube channel for as long as I can remember. Um, I used, like, the first video that I used to upload, like, videos where it was me, my younger brother, and, like, our mutual friends shooting Nerf guns at each other. Uh, I used to upload videos that I called, like, podcasts, where it was me and a friend, and three questions that we, I asked a question, we both talked about it, I asked the second question, like, yeah, I, I used to, I used to have no clue what I'm doing, and now I still don't have a clue what I'm doing, but I have figured out something. Um, all, all those old videos have been deleted, and then, um, there's an old Call of Duty, uh, video, uh, a Call of Duty Black Ops Zombies video that's still, like, privated or, like, unlisted. Uh, I might revisit that, because I think the old, like, the first Call of Duty game, uh, the first Black Ops game, that, nice, very nice. Um, my opinion of the Call of Duty franchise kind of dropped off after uh, Modern Warfare 3, but that's a topic for another day. And then in 2019, I started Yugi tubing. I started with opening some of the 2019 Megaton. Um, I did some deck profiles for Thunder Dragon and Endymion and Abyss Actors. Um, and then a bunch of COPPA stuff happened. And if you were here last year, you should remember that. But um, then, that that catches us, us up to Destro 48 in 2020. I had... Uh, gotten rid of all the videos from 2019 um, for fear that Coppa would strike me and I'd get a huge fine. Um, and then I didn't really know what I wanted to do. Uh, I also didn't have a reliable place to record. Uh, I still had like a roommate that I had in the same room uh, at all times. And not to get into like Desperate Oak 48 lore, I guess, but that also just wasn't the greatest living situation for me. Like I, I kind of Started off Destro 48 in a really rocky position. And um, actually in that first episode of Built From Nothing, uh, there's a couple of times where like when I'm filming on the black table, like my roommate is two feet across from me waiting for me to finish so he can uh, go off about whatever. A quarantine hit by episode three of Built From Nothing. Um, I had no idea what to do. Uh, if you've seen episode four of Built From Nothing, you'll see kind of how much of the bottom of the barrel I was scraping. But uh, with help from so many wonderful friends, um, if you guys have been around for a while, you will know and recognize, at the very least, Invoked 101 and TCG Cardcast. I know I mentioned them a lot and uh, like huge, massive shout outs to them. And then there's also been other uh, people I've been able to like hang out with and chat with. Uh, Legacy Crusaders is one dude who I like love uh, dueling and hanging out with. Like that guy is so talented when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh! dueling. Um, but like he genuinely knows his stuff when it comes to this game. It's because he's been playing for so long. One person, I I've been able to talk to Rufio a lot. Uh, all these people will be in the description, by the way. Uh, Rufio is a really cool dude. Um, he's from uh, the UK over the pond. Uh, I haven't been able to do a video with him, but I'm, I'm gonna want to do that at some point. And then more recently, um, the Coalition of Scrubs, uh, like just everyone in there um we've done a couple videos with uh from the deck yt um 
TCS has dropped by our streams a few a few times. He's actually the person who got us over 100. Like I could not be more thankful for TCS. I, I guess what I'm trying to say is that this year has been emotional for me. And um, <clears throat> when we got to that first, I guess the first milestone for me was episode 10 of Built from Nothing. And um, I that was kind of when I realized that well, no, DDD would not be actually topping a YCS anytime soon. I at least had something going for me. And then we added on um, game design in Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, we got to the point where I started doing live streams and uh, like Duel Links videos. And it, it was a lot of fun. Uh, like we've really, the channel has really come so far in even just less than a year. And to end... 2020 and began 2021 with over 100 subscribers is just mind-boggling to me and I like I don't I'm not the greatest at emoting I don't know if you guys have been able to pick up on that from any time I've mentioned it before I, I'm just not great at it but like I, I I can't put into words how happy I am to have not only hit 100 subscribers, but to have hit 117 by the end of 2020. The reason why 117 is because one of my two favorite game franchises of all time is Halo. Master Chief is CR117, 117. Hopefully you uh, get the picture here. Yeah. Next uh, milestone is to hit Shuckles Pokedex number in subscribers. And um, I'll let you guys figure that one out. Because Shuckles is my all-time favorite Pokemon. And while I have everything about that Pokemon memorized... I, uh, I want to help. I want I want some people to do some digging on their own. Um, there's kind of almost too much to say and not enough. Uh, like this year has been just so crazy. I I wanted to I guess recap the year in a sense, but I, I wasn't a hundred percent sure how to do that. So I guess I just kind of gave the backstory of the whole channel. But this is kind of where we find ourselves right now, and uh, I. I try my hardest to live in the present and to kind of focus on the here and the now. Uh, there are exceptions. Uh, when I, you know, go to school, go to class every day, I think about the future and uh, what I want out of class and out of my education. So that's a, a difference. But I, I think something that I've really come to realize over, uh, like over, especially quarantine, is that I don't, unlike games in the past, I don't necessarily play Yu-Gi-Oh to win. I, I I play it to have fun and enjoy the game. Uh, I like to like fuck around and cause chaos and mischief. And uh, I like if you guys have ever seen me duel. Like there's this, there is the live stream where I put Dragoon in defense twice, like completely on accident. Um, I've been having a lot of fun with the game, and uh, I I'm really, 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 really looking forward to what 2021 has to hold. Now that I am back at school, that does mean more live streams and less edited videos. Um, Built for Nothing, episode 20, will be coming out soon. Uh, I've had a lot of traveling. Uh, today is actually my last day of traveling. Uh, the day I'm recording this, which is December 31st. Last day of traveling, I started traveling December 26th. Like I, I've been either driving or flying ever since. So I'm very tired. I don't want to be editing videos. So I'm going to edit this and then go to, go to sleep. But um, I really, I just wanted to say thank you guys. Um, this year has been just crazy. It's been a mess. Um, but it's been an adventure. And I think if anyone is a fan of The Hobbit, you'll be able to agree with uh, the J.R. Tolkien sentiment, which is it's more about the journey and less about the destination. And I think that the journey we've had so far has been pretty awesome. I have learned streaming, uh, and in the process of that, caught a shiny uh, Roly Coley in Minecraft, which the stream was way too laggy for anyone to notice, which sucks. We had a dueling stream that was just dueling uh, viewers and subscribers. Like it was, uh, it was just like sitting down and checking chat, seeing who wants to duel and what order people want to duel in. Um, we've had we've tested so many decks on the EDO Pro. And uh, the next one I'm actually really excited for because it's a deck I'm going to be like physically building and I have some of the pieces like right here next to me. So uh, this isn't much of a hint, but one of them is Five-Headed Link Dragon. So that's neat. Finally, like the last thing I wanted to say is, um, and I, I think that it's a sentiment that you guys can probably uh, guess by now. I'm very excited for this year. 
the content I have planned is going to be, at least from my perspective, like through the roof. Dungeons, Dragons, and Duelists is probably going to be something that comes out every other week. Of course, now that I'm kind of back in school mode, I will be keeping you guys updated on what happens with that. I'll keep you guys informed, but Dungeons, Dragons, and Duelists is something I don't plan on ending. Uh, same goes for Built from Nothing. Uh, both might be put on a hiatus because of school, but I, I'm going to... I'm going to try to see uh, about that because I don't want to put either series on a hiatus. At the very least, I can promise that uh, the Minecraft streams are coming back. Uh, dueling streams, same thing. Edo deck, uh, deck testing, also coming back. I do want to do some more Star Wars streams. I, I'm i a big Star Wars fan. I don't really know what I'm doing here. Um, <clears throat> this, this year has been insane. And I, I don't know if I should recap it or tell it to go fuck itself. Because 2020 was such a, like, shit show, um, I personally know a lot of people who were, like, almost killing themselves with anxiety. They were overthinking all the time. Uh, they were just so stuck in their own heads. And I think that, at least for my sentimental ass, uh, the best way for me to end it is to leave you all with a quote that was told to me by uh, an old friend of mine. Just because something feels true doesn't mean that it is true. And so the idea behind that is, you know, if you feel like the world may be revolting against you, odds are it's not and you're just kind of in a rut right now. Everyone has their own way to get out of that rut. I would like to say that, um, guys, I, I hope you're all able to be able to pull yourself out of that rut. 2020 was not a catalyst of any sort. There's been signs of uh, all these things kind of exploding at some point, And it just so happened to all happen during the same year, which happened to be the year 2020. Doctors have been able to point out that a global pandemic would happen at any point during our lifetimes. Uh, at least in the United States, racial tensions have been rising since God knows when. But 2020 wasn't a catalyst by any means. If we really want to see change happen, uh, we we need to keep fighting. I I guess this has become less of a recap and more of a just me ranting. But um, it's been a year. Um, we're ending at 118 subscribers. The the next goal that I want to hit, I don't know if we'll be able to hit it by the end of the year. Shuckle's Pokedex number. I almost gave it away for you all. You, you almost tricked me. We'll see. But uh, I'm I'm ecstatic for this upcoming year and the content. And um, that's kind of all I have to say. Thank you guys very much. It, it's been such, 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 such an honor. Um, thank you to all the other yu tubers who have been on the road with me. Uh, again, like from Invoked101 to From the Deck YT. Uh, even some people who haven't been on the channel but are in the Deathstroke 48 Discord. Uh, like there's been a lot of people. And um, it's been amazing. And I, I couldn't be more thankful to be in the position I'm in. And with that being said... I need to go eat some chicken. Sorry for the weird cut there. I decided to swallow wind down the wrong pipe. Um, with that being said, I'm going to go eat some dino nuggets and drink some soda. And I'm going to edit this video and I'm going to go the fuck to sleep. Uh, again, just thank you guys so much. Uh, I've, uh, I'm, I'm Desperate 48 and, uh, welcome to 2021, everyone. We're going to, we're going to make this a better year than 2020. And, uh, that being said, I'll see y'all next time.